Right, Pirates, it's Tuesday the 28th of April 2020. Ahoy there. Otherwise known as Captain Craig's birthday. Um, it's been raining today, all day, and I've been stuck in my tent, so it's what I decided to do as a birthday present for Craig during this 2020 lockdown. As I've been spent my day to day downloading all of our Isle of Wight trip from 2018 on your Indolo. And I've put them all on my video editor, and I've been making a video of it all. So the 2018 uh, Isle of Wight trip aboard your Indolo, finally one video film, feature length film. Happy birthday, Craig. It's a pirate's life for me. Arr. Right, Pirates, it's Saturday the 4th of August, 2018. Oi. Oi. Got, got me little uh, Pirates, literally little Pirates this week. So uh, thank you to them, Mummy, because they turned up in Pirate Kit. How cool is that? Hello, Bert. See your Pirate Kit. He's been silly. Right. Sorry. What are you doing, Craig? Oh, I am. I'm going to get the uh, chart plotter working. Right, okay. That came with the boat. Came with the boat, but what were we looking at? Right, yeah. is the leads come out here, Yeah. but all the, plugs. the pin connectors like this were all in bits, yeah. effectively. So it's what Craig has, I've been watching him do, <laughs> is take all the little pins out, yeah, little pins. and then he's going to wire them on individually, separately, and plug them into the back of that. So, quite a fiddly job. Yep. But, um, why are you doing that then, Craig? Well, we're going sailing in a week. Where are we going, Craig? Off to the Isle of Wight. Off to the Wonky Calf. Wonky Calf. Yes. But also, so you know we've got this, I uh, bought the solar panel. In here, is one of these lantern wind generators. And they've got the, like vertical paddle things. Um, That's your box. There's the box. Magic box. Magic box and magicness. That is big. Wicked. So. Um, That's what it looks like. Oh yeah. There you go. That's what it looks like. It's one of these newfangled jobs. Cut hundred quid. Yep. Yeah. I thought it was gonna be a lot more than that. Yeah. But uh, I'm glad it wasn't. Otherwise we wouldn't have one. <laughs> yeah, <that's it. laughs> Right, Pirates, Saturday the 11th of August 2018. Board your Indolo. And uh, me and Craig and the crew of GNA are getting ready to go sailing. These guys are going to go to Brighton. We're going to go straight through to the Isle of Wight. Um, we did have a third crew member with us, um, but he vanished in the night. So uh, we're down to two. It's going to be quite tricky, we think. But still, one adventure. We've done loads of wiring up. The chart plotter works. Yep. The depth thing works. We've wired up a fuse board. We've got USB and charging ports out here. We've got floodlights. We've got... Oh, we've got loads of stuff, haven't we? Yeah. But I'll tell you what we haven't got is food and water. Nope. We have to go and get some of that, haven't we? We will. Yeah. And then we can set sail. Yeah, for the Isle of Wight. Here we come. Here we come. Craig. It's a pirate's life. It's a pirate's life for me. Ah! Oh, here we are, these. All right, we're doing it. We're going out backwards. We've just reversed out. And Craig's going to go for a full spin round, I think. So we're really late out. It is high tide now. GNA left a good hour and a half ago. Um, but yeah, we. Uh, like I say, I had a crew member disappear, so we've had a lot to do today. Uh, but we're going to get there, we're going to get there. Nice breeze, you may well be able to hear. But yeah, we just tried going backwards and realised we still had a line on. <laughs> Didn't we, Craig? Yeah, we did. That's a pirate ship there, Craig. Yeah. There you go. Farewell, Graham. Right then. On to Isle of Wight, pirates! 
So yes, we're gonna go 14 hour sail, gonna go and uh, anchor up at Whitecliff Bay and uh, see if we can find the crew of GNA. Greg, is it a pirate's life? It's a pirate's life for me. Arr. We are oh, sailing. sailing. Yes. Yes. Engines what? off. Engines off. Weather's lovely. It's actually it's much better out here than it was inland. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's quite nice and cool. And nowhere near as windy. For now. Yeah. Got a nice little angular hill. Absolutely, so many boats out. We never saw Pirate Pete though. No. There's a uh, not peachy head. So we're a couple of miles out. I think this time we're going to go right out and then in, aren't we? Yeah, tack in a bit. Across. Yeah, we want to be the other side of the wind farm this time, don't we? Definitely. Oh, look, the wind generator's going. Good, good. Wicked. Excellent. Better see if it's doing anything. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, solar panel out. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. We need to uh, do something with the mainsail because I'll tell you what, it's so hard getting that up. So, so hard. We're just on the wind at the minute. And we're going to tack in a little while once we get out far enough. Um, and go from there. It's probably. It's going to be like 2 in the morning or so when we get to. Uh, what's it called, aren't we? Isle of Wight. Isle of Wight. Yeah, Whitecliff Bay. Whitecliff Bay. So, Jeff and the Wonky Calf. Here we come. We're coming for you, mate. Right, pirates. We're under sail, but we've just put the engine on flat out because uh, we're now trying to catch up GNA, who's just passed that headland down there. We're doing like eight knots under the engine. Yep. Look at the wind generator. Splashes up the bow, like anyway. We're coming for you, GNA! We're coming for ya! Right, pirates. We had to put the Jenny away. We're, uh, we're in irons. Um, and Steve phoned us from GNA, so we're under motor heavy trying to catch her up. But the spray coming out on the boat from the bow is nuts. I can feel it hitting my face. Awesome. Oh, it's a shame Master is here. He'd have loved this. He wouldn't know how to do it himself, he'd work out the mast, wouldn't he? There's a really nice breeze, it's just a shame it's going the wrong way. Look at that go! Yeehaw! Look at all the kemp trails in the sky as well. There would not be a cloud in the sky today if it wasn't for them fuckers. But anyway... Boats! Boats! I love being a pirate! Craig, you love being a pirate! I love being a pirate! Ah! Right, pirates, if you can hear me through the wind, there's GNA, the um, 1836 oyster catching smack that we went sailing onto Eastbourne. We've caught her up and the engine. We've got a lovely angle here on the go. The sea is awesome. Oi, Melody! Look at that wind jenny going. There they are. Getting close now, pirates. Should we pull the um, jenny back out and tack with them? You want to? There they are! Oh hi, me oldies! Yeah, baby! Oh, this is it, pirates! 
Pirates in tandem. We're gonna uh, get the jelly out and start doing a bit of sailing for the boys over there. Oh, fucking love it. It's a pirate's life. Arr! Right, so there they are, pirates. Steve and his motling crew, merry men. Prepare the boarding ladders, Craigus. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Aston, man. Where are you, boy? Where are you? Right near you, ain't nowhere. Ahoy, my ladies. Hey. There they are. Look at that. She is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. See, the thing is, when we were sailing on her, we never got to see it with the sounds out, did we, Craig? No, you couldn't see. No. She's looking good, men. She's looking good. Look at that. See that diagonal one that comes up at the top of the mainsail there? That is called a gaff, which is why it's a gaff cutter. And look at that sail out on the bowsprit. That is sexy. Really sexy. I'm going to pull the Jenny out, boy. Go for it. Yeah. Right, pirates, we're back on the sail again now. We've caught our people. There they are. Sound of absolute peace. Oh, there's no one at the helm. There's no one at the helm, Craig. So, anyway, here it is. Oh, it's got a TV reel up. Wind in your sails, beautiful Jolly Roger flying. Are they making their turn? Think they're gonna attack. Look at that, absolutely beautiful. We had to see what that wind jenny's doing in a sec. Look at that. Oh, so, uh, yeah, we'll, like I say, we'll get to the Isle of Wight stupid o'clock in the morning. Um, Do a bit of anchor watch for a while. I'm gonna catch some fish tomorrow. Look at Gina, she is beautiful. Uh, we got loads of uh, munch, loads of uh, sailing food, pot noodles, fray bentos pies. <laughs> Cheap and cheerful, nice and simple. Yeah, well, we both need both needed out here, really, aren't we? It is actually Cow's Week as well at the Isle of Wight, isn't it, the last few days? Yeah, it is, yeah. So, um, loads of boats around. Yeah, hopefully we can actually anchor. Yeah. Imagine if we can't. Well, that'd be quite mad. <laughs> well, we've got a long anchor chain, we can go out. Yeah. But it just means we're uh, riding the waves. Just don't go in the shipping lane. Yeah, fuck the shipping lane. Anyway, alright. Yeah, some wicked splashes up the bow earlier. They're getting away from us. Nice angle of hill. Grace is trying to sail in. What a beautiful day. I think it's actually better out at sea than it was inland. You can actually see the weather over land. But us pirates, going to be out here. We thought it was going to be rough as anything, didn't we? We did, yeah. We were, we were told it was going to be 30 minutes today. It didn't put us off though, Craig, did it? No. Not on a beastie like this. No. I mean, we're so high off the water, it's ridiculous. Twice as high as GNA, easily. Easy, I mean, that they must have been getting wet. Well, mind you, they wouldn't have been going as fast as us with that. Yeah. But, um, whoa, shit, the fucking bed. <laughs> Go on, then he went down the hatch. And he fell down there. Come on. Doing that? No. Craig, my teacup's empty. Yeah. Well, Red Bull time, innit? Oh, yeah, I suppose it's over Red Bull. <laughs> Craig, 
Is it a pirate's life? It's a pirate's life for me. Ah. Well, pirates. Once again, we're sailing. Don't know where Stephen is. Look, oh, can you see them? They're miles away down there. Oh shit, I think. Um, basically, we want to get past that big headland, so we did a short tack, and now we're going for a longer tack back out. We want to go past that headland in one, ideally. Um, there's weather coming in. Pressure's dropping. It's cooled right down now. I've got a feeling we're going to get some rain at some point in the next uh, 12 hours or so, maybe less than that, by looking at that. Um, we just had a little splutter in the engine. I wonder if uh, we're wondering how, how much diesel we've used. But anyway, we're sailing now, so uh, we don't need the engine. That's where we are, if you can see that. Big old boat on the front there. I don't know if you can see that. That's a big power boat. But she's sailing nicely. Um, I don't know how fast we're going. Not that fast, but it's a nice speed. Um, but yeah, this weather is going to be interesting. But we did know. Have you just made tea? Yep. Aren't you a good boy? Tea, Thank you, Captain. I'm just saying, it looks like there's some weather coming in over there, boy. Interesting. Yeah, I reckon by tonight we're going to be sailing in the dark in the rain. Right. That'll be a good one, won't it? No sign of them. No, they're miles away, mate. Um, oh, I did see a red and white thing They're down there. But they are a long way. Oh, but they've got to go around that headland. Yeah. So why are they so far in? Not too sure. Yeah. Unless they're giving up and going to Eastbourne. Well, maybe. They've uh, they've got a lot of sailing experience, so uh, they obviously know more than us. But you know, we we'll just get out and do it. <laughs> Oh, it's so nice on this boat. She uh, so beautiful in the water. Really nice. We uh, we were motor sailing a little while ago, and uh, the wind's died down a little bit now. But we had a good wind. But we were just trying to get in a little bit, and uh, we were really riding the chines. And she handles very well. I haven't had to move the uh, wheel in ages. So awesome. But there, just a little update. But it's this weather. This weather, pirates. It's coming up four in the afternoon. The weather's still holding out. But there is definitely some weather coming in down there. G&A has made a tack behind us. But we're doing a massive tack. We're, uh, can you see those big rectangle things? They're freight container ships. They're massive. I mean, really massive. Um, so we're quite far out now. Um, and then is what we're going to do. We'll turn and tack past the headland in one massive long tack, hopefully. What do you reckon, Kevin? I reckon it's on, yeah. yeah. What yeah. are you up to, by the way? Just rewired this uh, depth gauge. Well, plug came out. Plug came out. Because it fell off the thing, didn't it? Um, well, that freight container at the back is really catching that other one up. He's oh. trying to overtake him, isn't he? They are going so. Really going so. Uh, uh, God knows what time we're going to get to the Isle of Wight at this rate. God knows. Tomorrow? Yeah, definitely tomorrow. Well, I mean, like, really tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow day. Yeah, not like two in the morning. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. Yeah, so we'll be doing our first night sail yeah. on Indolo. Hopefully the lights work. Frost. We had a problem with the engine a little while ago. It coughed and spluttered and then cut out twice. Yeah, got a bit of air in it. That was a bit scary, wasn't it? It was a bit dodgy, yeah. 
Mind you, I did get quite excited because I thought, yes, <laughs> we've literally got to get there. But obviously, we don't really want that. But you know, when you get very excited about something crazy that's going on. <laughs> Yes, what we like, it's what pirates do. Oh dearie me. Oh, it's lovely sailing though. Absolutely lovely sailing. Yeah. I'm still quite knackered from my week at work. I've had a really hard couple of weeks. Quite tired, but I was worse this morning actually. Look, he's overtaking that one now, look. He's gonna drive straight up the arse of him, isn't he? Get out! <laughs> no, actually, we're quite close now, aren't we? Yeah. We'll have to be doing a bit of tacking soon, won't we, pirate? I think so, pirate. Because <laughs> it looks, in fact, there is another massive one coming up the back there. Yeah. Oh, dear. But anyone that's watched any of our videos will know that we've had a few run-ins with ships already, so... One of which was quite scary. <laughs> Yeah, it was a bit hairy. We had no lights or anything, <laughs> so they didn't even know we were there, did they? No. Oh dear. Interesting. Yeah, check this out. What did we do? We're doing four knots. That's alright. Oh, yeah. Where does it say that? Oh, up the top. I was bloody looking for that. I don't know if you can see that camera, but yeah. So here we are. Look, you can see where we are, and then we're going to do a massive tack out past Beachy. But we love the way she rides the chines. Yeah, it's very nice. So the chines, for those who don't know, are the met metal ridges in the uh, side of the boat at the bottom. Yeah. And basically, when you're sailing or whatever, they become the new keel, basically, don't they? The line of the chine becomes the bottom of the boat. Yeah, something, yeah. And that is called riding the chines. So we were doing a bit of that under engine, though, because. Uh, the wind's not that strong, although she is sailing nice. With nice oh, well, it's, we've gone down a little bit, 3.6. But it looks like that wind's going to pick up before too long, yeah. if I'm honest. Still see uh, Steve in the distance, GNA. Yeah, they're tacking up behind, aren't they? Yeah, they're coming up. They'll probably catch us up again. <laughs> they're probably miles in front of us. They seem quite fast, don't they? Yeah, they're really, she's really quick, GNA, isn't yeah. they? Yeah. It, but basically, when it's higher winds, yeah. when you've got when you the sails as as effective as GNAs, you're really going to have to be reducing them down, and I don't even know how you do that. But yeah, yeah. it's got reefing points on it, but yeah, you wouldn't have it way up. For sure. No, for sure, not if you can go that speed when uh, yeah. when it's light winds. Yeah, bloody hell. Interesting. Yeah. Anyway, I think I'm going to chuck a couple of pot noodles on shortly. Wicked. Oh, right. Anyway, Craig, is it a pirate's life? It's a pirate's life for me. Oh. Hi, pirates. Captain Craig is here. Nelson Singebeard is at the helm. There he is. Probably won't hear him. I don't know whether you'll hear me. It's quite windy up here. The sail's out. We've got the engine on, but the uh, wind's helping us for sure. Really nice angle of hill. Riding the waves. Wind jenny spinning like mad. Waves coming up the side. Excellent. So here's the captain. Oi, my He's at the hill. Yeah. We just put her up to full blast. What speed was we doing? 9.3 was the fastest. 9.3, just in case you didn't hear that. Yeah, so, uh, That's ground speed. I tell you, I had to do a bit more steering. <laughs> uh, we were over like that. Yeah, yeah, there was a good angle of hill. Yeah, lovely. Now wind's keeping us over. It looks a bit dark and grey over there, but. Yeah, I know. As you can 
Reefer down, boys. Reefer down, boys. Excellent. Look at the Jenny. Look at it. Whee! Captain. Captain. Is it Pirate's Life? It's Pirate's Life for me. Ah. Right, Pirates. It's like half five in the evening now on the Saturday. Um, the crew of GNA have decided not to go to Brighton. Right, they're going to go to Eastport. There's some weather coming in. Uh, I don't know if they necessarily want to sail at night. But uh, me and Craig are going to sail straight through, or motor sail, should I say, straight through to um, the Isle of Wight. The Isle of Wight. Um, we have put a reef in our sail, in our main sail already. As you can see, just getting ready because. Uh, yeah, the pressure's dropped right on the right down on the barometer. Uh, it's now right down the change. Um, we are expecting a bit of wind and a bit of sea. Uh, let's just hope it all goes well, and we uh, and it's not too bad to anchor or whatever. So uh, we might actually be all right the way it's coming from. Because I think they're sheltered from the south uh, southwest. Yeah. Anyway, we're going strong, but we've had to put the engine on. So it's been a lovely day. We've not long had a pot noodle, and for dinner we got Frey Pent Frey Bentos steak steak pie. Yeah. Um, I put a kettle on a little while ago, so that's probably bored now. I'm gonna go and make a cup of tea, but. I tell you what, we love Indolo. She love it. She the beast. So much room. Lots of ships on the horizon. Big bastards. We're right out near the shipping lane now. Um, heading down towards Beachy Head, and then from there you go to Celsi Bill, which is the scary bit, and then uh, onto the Isle of Wight. But it will be pitch black when we get there. Again. Again. It's just coming up 7 o'clock in the evening. And there's Beachy Head. I've just whacked the oven on. Gonna do a Frey Bentos uh, steak pie. Um, and then really we're getting ready for the old... Uh, for the night ships, Craig. Lots of big boats on the horizon. And actually there's quite a few lots about, but it is the end of uh, Cow's Week it's been, so. Um, so yeah, they're probably all going home now. But in fact, they're probably all leaving now because they know this weather's coming. Yeah, quite possibly. Ah, <laughs> bollocks. And we're going there. Oh, this better not be Eastbourne part two. We'll get us placed then. They're all going. Yeah, I know, but can you imagine, right, if we, uh, we get all the way there and we can't anchor because it's too rough or something. Or we have to go round into the solar Or turn around and come home. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> no, we're staying out. Yeah. Yeah, we love it. We want to see what Indy can do. Yeah. Uh, she's been sailing really lovely. Uh, we have got the engine on uh, a little bit just to help us, just because we want to bloody get there. Yeah. We're keeping as close to the wind as we can get. Yeah. Um, yeah, but it would be nice to get anchored before all this weather gets us. Yes, definitely. So, um, when I stop filming in a minute, I'm going to go and put these pies in. We'll put some revs under on the engine. Yeah. Because uh, we can do eight knots under engine quite happily, and that's not even too high up, is it? Yeah, it's good. So, uh, that'll help. Yeah. That'll help, because uh, it's definitely getting colder. I could well be in the old Canada Goose later. So it's half eight at night now. Um, this weather hasn't really done anything. Um, we're under sail again. Um, but actually, there's not very much wind. That's how fast we're going.
Um, so we're going to put some more diesel in there and uh, start the engine up again because uh, well, it's obviously pointless. Find some diesel on a white. Uh oh. Uh oh. We've only got one more can left after this. Really? Mm. Fuck. There's a ship there, so make sure we miss that. Shit, that's big and it's coming right for us. That's coming straight for us, isn't it? Change my course, head right inland. Yeah. Oh god, it's pirate's life, no, alright? <laughs> <sure. laughs> right, pirates, this is serious. We've just run out of diesel, so we hove to. And, oh, it's gone past now. That thing, right? Oh my god, that was so close to us. And it's making it, it made its turn around us. I think we were in its way. We were in its way, weren't we? <laughs> I could hear them on their tannoy telling the people they're approaching their destination. <laughs> Fuck yeah, now. We always do this, don't we? It's good, isn't it? Yeah! <laughs> 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 Fuck yeah, now. Well, anyway, we're home to in the uh, channel. <laughs> Should we just go to sleep now, Craig? Yeah, might as well. Big old chips passing by. <laughs> Fuck yeah, now. There's one coming out in a minute, probably. Yeah, I know. That... Oh, we're home to, Craig. I don't think we've been home to you before, have we? <laughs> no, it says 2.6 knots. Actually, it says 3 knots, but I think that's backwards. If I'm honest. I think we're actually going uh, back towards where we came from. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking hell. Right, we need to get this engine started. around here, didn't it, eh? Fuck me. Wind farm in the distance. Don't know if you can see any light. Oh, the lights are starting to come on now everywhere. Bloody hell, that ship was close. Fuck okay, you now. It's a pirate's life. Hi, right, pirates. It's uh, nearly quarter to one in the morning. We are sailing. We got low on diesel, so we turned the engine off. 7.5 knots we're doing. And it turns out we're doing uh, over seven knots constantly. I can get it to eight and a half if I turn a couple of degrees out of course, but we're getting near Celsius, so we've got to be a bit careful. We've got to stick to a course. Now wind Jenny's spinning right round. It's uh, quite a clear night up there as well. Yeah, it's awesome, man. It's very good. Okay. Waves on the bow. Waves on the bow. We've got the angle of hill. Not that you can see. Don't know where my torch is, but it's on 20 degrees. Loving it. Thinks it's a bit tricky walking around. But otherwise, it's excellent. Down the back here, I've got some diesel. Pumping oh. away in the room. 7.8. Eight knots, apparently. Oh. 8.4. 8.4. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. 8.4 knots. 8.1. Pirate's life. Oh, it's Pirate's life for me, Cannon. Oh. Oh. Right, Pirates, it's five to five in the morning. 
in and we're really all the way. We've just anchored up, putting the kettle on, there's all the ships anchored out. Um, we're going to do some anchor watch yep. and then uh, go to bed. But look, the sun is just coming out. The sun is just starting to rise where we came from. It's been a, a very long and it's just started to rain. Yeah, it's been it a is. long it, and tiring day. Yeah. We beat the rain! Woo! I can't believe that. It's got to be a first, isn't it? Mm. Well, we better um, get all the cushions in it, did not we? Yeah. Uh, yeah, we've done it. So, uh, tomorrow, what are we doing tomorrow, Greg? Sleeping. <laughs> Drinking rum. Yeah, exactly that. So, uh, <laughs> wicked. Greg? Is it Pirate's Life? It's Pirate's Life for me! Arr. Right Pirates, so it's Saturday, uh, Sunday the 12th of August 2018 About 2 o'clock in the afternoon Me and uh, Gregus Are doing absolutely nothing We're chilling out at our anchorage Look at the carnage everywhere It was worse than that last night, wasn't it? We had fenders in here. Oh, God, you couldn't fucking walk around anywhere. But anyway, let's have a look. I'll show you where we are. That's it, Whitecliffe Bay. All the big ships anchored out there. Five this morning, said it. Yeah. Went to bed, up again at 11. Yeah. So we're doing sod all today. Sod all. Absolutely nothing. So we're a bit glad the weather's a bit crap. I might get a fishing rod out later. Um, one thing before we go is uh, we've run out of diesel. We haven't got any diesel for the way home. So that's going to be interesting. But I'm not even going to think about that till tomorrow. Don't worry about that then. I'm going to see Jeff and see what we can do. Huh? I'm going to see Jeff. Oh, yeah, from the Monkey Cafe. Well, it looks shut today. Yeah. Well, just because it's Sunday and it's crappy. Oh, it is Sunday, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so uh, we're in a beautiful place. We got here. It was so hard with just the two of us, wasn't it, Craig? Yeah, it's been nettering. Absolutely exhausting. I thought, oh, I started tripping out towards Celsi. Yeah. All the lights in the distance, I thought they were all boats hanging. Oh, it was really weird. Mm. You saw the dredger? Oh, yeah, massive dredger. Nearly got hit by a ferry. Yeah. Uh, fun quite exciting, really, wasn't it? Yeah. And the wind last night, oh, my God. Yeah, well, After a day of not really, you know, loads and loads of... It was on and off sailing all day, wasn't it? Yeah. And then when it got dark and that, that made the wind picked up, the sea picked up, and... Uh, we were sailing. 9.4 knots. Under sail, no engine. No engine at all, just sail. Mm -hmm. And it was sustained above eight and a half for uh, hours. Yeah. And before then, it was sustained at seven and a half for ages. So, yeah, amazing sailing. I'm gutted that we, it was just us. Yeah. It's a shame, but I'm glad we did it. Well, yeah, that's it. Nothing was going to stop us, was it? No. So, uh, um, so, yeah, so today we're not going to do a lot. No. We might show you around tomorrow or something. We don't know what we're going to do yet. We might just end up searching for diesel. Yeah. <laughs> Spending the last of our remaining money on it, no <laughs> doubt. Oh, is it a pirate's life, Captain? It's a pirate's life for me. Ah.
Good morning, Pirates. It's Monday the 13th of August, 2018. Aboard your Indolo at Whitecliff Bay, the Isle of Wight. We're anchored a bit further away than we normally were, but we anchored in the dark and it's really hard to tell. We have to be a bit deeper in this thing anyway. Um, but we're, the anchor's really well set, so, so we've just left her where she is. Um, we had lots of rest yesterday. Me and Craig basically didn't even leave the safety of the boat yesterday. Like, I mean, we barely even came outside the boat. Um, we were just absolutely knackered after that sail here. Um, but we have run out of diesel. We, have, I mean, literally, we can't even start the engines at the minute because we haven't got that enough to uh, really do that. Um, so we're going to go... Right over there to the wonky calf, our main man Jeff. I think his wife was called Pat, if I remember correctly. And I tell you what, they uh, fantastic people. Really nice place. Who look after you? Oh, there's a kayak right out there on the edge of that cliff. Um, but we got to go and find some diesel, Craig. Ahoy! Yes, Ahoy. we have indeed. So there's a good chance we're going to spend our day walking with barrels of diesel on our shoulders today. Yep. And no, we was prepared for it today. We wasn't doing anything yesterday. Nothing at all. I was half asleep most of the day. Had a bit of a tummy ache. Yeah. So uh, we just yeah, did nothing. Time passed pretty quickly as well. Yeah. yeah. It did. It went really quick. That's cool. Haven't caught any fish yet. No. The seagulls are there. Bloody teasing us. It's nice and calm today though. So. Yeah, they're probably all right in now because the tide's up. We had to do some good stuff. But... There we go. So our adventure today is uh, getting diesel, Craig. Diesel, yeah. Is it a pirate's life? It's a pirate's life for me. Arr. Right, pirates, we're aboard the kayak. Oi, Captain. We're uh, just about to start on our uh, little mission to see if we can go and find some diesel. And uh, in the meantime, we'll just watch our beautiful beast disappear in the background. Look at that. You can see all the chinks on the edge of it where that fucking post has battered us. That's well out of order. There she is, anchor chains. Girl yeah. wobbling around. Good old girl. Pirate flags. Pirate flags, oi. Anyway, we're going that way. Oh, how many miles do you think we're going to have to walk with barrels of diesel then, Craig? Don't know. Hopefully someone will uh, help us out. Hmm. But in the meantime, is our plan is to go and get a breakfast at the Monkey Calf, cross Jeff's palm with a bit of silver, yeah. and then uh, pick his brain for a bit of local knowledge. That's what we be doing. Right. We've just been and had uh, another fantastic breakfast at the... Uh, the Wonky Cafe on Whitecliffe Bay. Absolutely gorgeous here, loads of people uh, enjoying the, the sea. Um, so as you know, we've run out of diesel and we went a nice breakfast and uh, Pat got Jeff on the phone because he's not been there because his dog's been bitten by an adder. Um, and he's going to be down this afternoon with his truck and take us down the petrol station. Excellent. So, uh, well done, Good Jeff. Idea. Yeah, they're uh, fantastic. They really look after you here. But uh, it just seems every time we come here, we've got some sort of issue going on. Um, so we're going to get some diesel. We'll see if we can let, see if you'll let us buy him a beer or something. Yep. So, uh, so right, pirates. So it's two quarter past two, two. Um, on the Sunday afternoon. Um, so we've got a couple of hours till we go and meet Jeff at the Wonky Calf who hopefully he's going to save our bacon uh, in return for beer. Um, so in the meantime, um, we've realised that the wind generator isn't actually working. Um, we had kind of figured this out because the voltmeter uh, wasn't changing at all when we were uh, when it was going. And it's like, the thing's 400 fucking watts, you know what I mean? So it should be doing something. We've got a 50 watt solar panel that absolutely kicks ass, so this should be really good. So we're going to take that apart in a sec. Yeah, a bit 
Um, we'll have a little look at the connections and then uh, we'll put it back together and wing it back up before we go and see Jeff. Yep. But before we do that, what are we doing, Craig? Cup of tea first. Cup of chopper. Cup of chopper. Oh, that's hey. what we like. But I tell you, we've really got our, we've got our sea legs on today. Yep. Uh, the boat's rocking around and we're just standing around it's like good. normal. Yesterday, <laughs> we were uh, all over the place, weren't we, doing the uh, the shuttle run down the galley and that. Without the rum. Without the rum. Yeah, so uh, got the sea legs on. When we had our breakfast, we could feel a bit of wobbling going on, couldn't we? Yeah, sitting on land. The old big wave coming by. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> So, pirates, this is White Cliff Bay. Absolutely beautiful. And uh, Jeff, very kindly, from the Wonky Calf, is going to take us and get some diesel in a little bit. We feel bad that he's sort of got to do that for us, but it is what it is. They're very nice people. We would do the same to people in need for sure yeah. in fact I'm always doing stuff to help people on their bloody boats aren't I yeah, that's right. <laughs> <I'm gonna sink. laughs> oh shit <laughs> looking through a camera I walk straight into the puddle <laughs> right pirates we've just made it back I'm very very wet there's some big old waves at the uh, beach there we've got two drums of diesel Jeff from the Wonky Calf took us down to the petrol station. We so we've got 50 litres, which is effectively half what we used this week uh, coming here. That being the case, it means we can only actually motor for five hours tops, um, which is a bit of a shitter. So that means that we really have to sell. I mean, this is uh, almost a matter of survival now in that respect, isn't it, Craig? We got there, haven't we, pirate? We have to say, oh, we love it. Yes. And we get help along the way from people like Jeff, uh, who's absolutely awesome. We are sorry to have to do it to you, Jeff, but don't you worry, me, Arnie. We've uh, we've got a good idea for what we're going to get you for your uh, to say thank you. We're going to leave. We're going to leave tomorrow afternoon um, because. Well, basically, it's going to take us a lot longer to get back. Ideally, we want to make the afternoon tide on Wednesday. Three o'clock, I think it is. Because Craig's got to be at work on Thursday. And uh, I definitely would like to be back if I'm feeling up to it. Um, but yeah, it's been a, so far an awesome adventure. Uh, after adventure with sailing is uh, overcoming uh, obstacles, it seems. Fun. So it's a good job we got our sea legs on now because uh, we're moving around a little bit. Oh, and by the way, the wind generator does work. It just wasn't going fast enough. Whee! So uh, I don't have to throw it at sea now. Ah, oh, dearie me. I highly recommend this, people. It's definitely character building, if nothing else. And you know what? It's a pirate's life. Ah! It's a little view out of our saloon window. That's stopped now, got it, hasn't it? We were just rocking so much. Yeah, take calm. <laughs> oh, here we go. No? Unbelievable. The boat's been going nuts. And I thought, oh, I'll get the camera out. The second I got it out, it stopped. It's get, getting a bit bigger. It's nothing like it was a minute ago, though, is it? Nice views though out the window. Nice views. We had a really good trip. We haven't really done much, but we're on a boat, so we don't really need to. A bit of fishing. Went to see Jeff and Pat. Um, ended up needing their help, but 
That's what life's about, you know. If Jeff ended up a rye, and was like, no, I broke him down. Me and Craig would be out there in no time. No time at all. Because that's what it is. What a beautiful night at anchor. Got the ships with Jupiter above them in the distance. Got the white cliffs with Venus above it and all the caravan place. More ships anchored off the bow. It's just so much to look at. It's so beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Hi, Captain. Hi. What do you love the most about being on a boat at anchor? Floating, rocking. Yeah, there's so amazing, isn't there, about the rocking? Yeah. You can't really appreciate it in a boat. No. Oh, in the camera, sorry. Yeah, it's beautiful. We keep getting uh, every now and again just these sets of uh, quite big rollers that come in. Uh, <coughs> Starts pitching right over. Pitching right over. But actually, it's quite chilled at the minute. A few wires and stuff rocking around. But we've we've got just so used to it now. And just literally just stand still, the world moves around us. Yeah, become one. We've become the ocean. Yes, excellent. Yeah, exactly. There is a famous quote, I can never remember who says it, but it's if you don't become the ocean, you'll be seasick your entire life. And I tell you what, it ain't wrong. Absolutely beautiful. We'll be setting sail tomorrow on what is going to probably be a very long, very tiring journey. We're just sort of chilling out, getting ready to get our heads down in a bit, mentally preparing ourselves for the challenge tomorrow. It's supposed to be 20 knots from the west, so that would be bloody good. Um, yeah, if, if the wind stops at all, um, we're pretty much buggered. <laughs> pretty much, yeah. Oh, but we love it, don't we? We do. We don't let things like this put us off, do we? No, we're just planning to leave a bit earlier and we should be alright. We should be alright. Save the diesel off when we need it. Yeah. If we need it. If we need it. Well, when we need it, harbouring up and stuff. Yeah. But otherwise, uh, mm. yeah, last night here. Oh, well now I'm going to miss it. Yeah. Stephen, when you're doing nothing, it's getting slowly cradled and rocked by the ocean, by the sea. You're in the odd creek. Which doesn't creak as much as we thought. No, I think all that creaking's off the anchor chain, isn't it? There's something down here. Oh, is it? Oh, so it is a bit of woodwork creaking in. Yeah. Yes, yeah, a real creak. We didn't really have any yesterday, did we? Up a bit. Yeah, good. That's what we need. Settled. We're starting to run her in, maybe, then. Mm. Awesome. But we definitely need to sort out what's going on with this engine, because should not be using 10 litres of diesel an hour. Uh, <sighs> yeah. Anyway, good night, pirates. Is that pirate's life, Captain? It's a pirate's life for me. Ah. Oh. Right, pirates, so it's Tuesday the 14th of August, 2018. I know it's coming up nine in the morning now, I suppose. I've just been sitting here with me fishing rod for the last hour. Trying to catch Jeff some uh, mackerel before we go. Helping us out. It's become a, <laughs> it's starting to become a bit of a tradition, I think. <laughs> Pick
come and see Jeff and get saved. <laughs> oh dear. But yeah, it's been a lovely few days, chilled out. We quite like just dosing around at anchor, it's pretty cool. A bit of fishing and just watching the world go by. There's a little fisher boat out there down sitting these little boys. So in a few hours we'll be setting sail. Oh look, there's a head poking out of the hatch there. Morning Craig. I was going to come and wake him up after this video because the alarm went off. We've got to go and have breakfast and that soon. There's a cup of tea in the kitchen for you. But yeah, beautiful morning. Just thought I'd uh, just taking the last little bit of uh, scenery and beauty of this place before we go. The wind isn't going to be as strong as it was supposed to be. Again. Always does that. Um, and we really need the wind as well. Uh, we're going to allow sort of 24 hours to get back. It's going to be really hard work, I think. But there you go. That's what it's about. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. And if you can survive an ordeal like that, I mean, just... It's going to be quite a good sailing experience, really, you know, knowing that you have to do it. <laughs> Even if the wind stops or whatever, it's... Uh, I suppose you just have to sit there, look out for ships. Yacht in the low. We're going to do a 360 degree for you, just to show you how beautiful she is. Yo, pirate flag! R. R. Wind Jenny. Yeah, Wind Jenny. There's the beautiful big bum that I sleep in. Flying the Jolly Roger. Right, pirates. There appears to be a Coast Guard helicopter. I could shoot that with me fucking air rifle from here. What is it up to? What are you doing? Go away! We're not the sort of pirates you want, motherfuckers! Right above that black thing! having a rescue. This is better than EastEnders. Hey. Oh, they have found the right person. Yeah. Who's in distress, man? Or they just say perfectly still. Don't crash into it, bird! He's going, is he? Go on, get out of here! Bloody scallywags. Don't 
You're not a big red sailing yacht. It's probably them lot. There he goes, panic over. Right pirates, it's Tuesday the 14th of August 2018, about half past two in the afternoon. We are just getting ready to uh, set sail to go home. We're just gonna have a pot noodle and a cup of tea. Um, Craig's just messing with the chart plotter. Ahoy. Um, we've just been gathering stuff up and getting ready and uh, yeah, just mentally preparing ourselves because look, she's quite bumpy today, people, and pretty bloody windy if you can hear. We've had all sorts of distress calls on the uh, radio. Helicopters flying around. In the distance is the Wonky Cafe where we uh, have been thoroughly looked after once again. <laughs> um, now it's that away. Uh, we haven't got enough diesel to get us there, so we need to do a lot of sailing, but as you can tell, it is windy, so we should be all right. Um, we're gonna start off under motor get out of the bay till we see what's going on with the, you know, the real weather and uh, and get going towards Celsius. Yes. Have you had a good week, few days, Craig? Been nice. Yeah. It's been chilled. Good. It took us a day to recover from the ordeal of uh, sailing. Yes. Um, it could be a lot longer and a lot worse today. If we uh, are really quick, because obviously we've allowed lots of time, because uh, we have to sell. But if we are really quick, we'll just be anchored at the uh, fairway boy. Not good, pirates. We're trying to get, oh, we've had all sorts of problems already. Yeah. The seas are huge. The wind won't let us go where we want to go. We might be in trouble. Turn them ribs down. <laughs> oh my God. This is insane. Oh, we were getting battered. Absolutely battered. You should see the state of the indoors. That was fucking hairy. We got a halyard caught round the uh, spreader. Yeah. Two anchor chains tangled up. And then massive seas. We got knocked over by the huge, huge, huge sea. They are big rollers. State of the inside. Absolute madness. Oh. Wish us luck. <laughs> wish us luck, pirates. Oh my god. We've only been there 10 minutes. So 
There's a Navy ship coming straight for us. Oh, he's just turned around us. He's just changed. He has just changed his course. He has just changed his course. Hey, he's going straight for us. <laughs> I just gave him a bit of a salute because I do you what that was fucking scary. Look at that big fucker. Look at him. There he is. Oh, excuse me. There he is. Check it out. Navy bloody warship. Check that beast. That, we were on a collision course for that. on a collision course for that and he's turned well on the boys these seas are huge they just don't look it because they're so long that was a bit scary that navy ship thing wasn't it it was a bit scary it started turning straight for us straight at us it's always really scary when they do that the bastards yeah. And then as they come past, they're looking at us through machine guns on the back of their uh, wagon, through the telescopes, the bastards. It's been scary, isn't it? Yeah. Pirates life. Ah. Oh. Right, pirates. We're butterfly sailing. Butterfly. Butterfly sailing on the way back. Mate, you wouldn't believe what just happened. The fucking boom came off the mast. I just had to find a big nut and bolt in there. Boom came off the mast! Oh my god, you wouldn't believe the carnage we've had today! Absolute madness, through and through! But we're doing it! We've still got the engine on! We're trying to hold this butterfly position! We've had some mega war! Oh, honestly, I don't even know where to start today! Don't even know where to start, but we're doing it! We are! Coming up to Celsius Bill, we've still got the engine on for now, but we'll turn it off in a bit! Uh, fucking hell, is that a pilot's life? Pilot's life for me! Ah! Oh. Right, pirates, you will not believe the shit we've been through today. Hey, Craigus, I'm telling you, if it could have gone wrong so far, it bloody well has. We, uh, we got the anchor stuck, didn't we? Yep. That was really hard work. Then what happened? Oh, then we pulled out into these huge waves and we couldn't get the sails any way right. Um, and we kept getting knocked down and everything has been smashed. My brand new massive water filter thing is all smashed. Pretty much everything's all smashed. Um, the boom came off at the mast. Then, then, whilst trying to after just shaking out a reef the traveller's gone flying across ripped it right off managed to save the rope it has to come out there, the stops, oh the stops it's ripped the stop right at the end so that's gone off I've now got that triangulated off the two Samson posts at the back but fucking hell man I'm telling you most people would have given up by now wouldn't they Craig yeah I think they would have it's been quite scary today, hasn't it? Yeah, it's been a bit hairy. And now it's really died down, but to the point where... How fast are we going, Craig? Yeah, three and a half, three minutes, four-ish. So at that speed, it'll take us 30, 30 hours to get back. It's a long time. It is rather, isn't it? Mm. We might be quite tired by then. Yeah. That's if there's anything left of this bloody boat still. We can't get the sails in any way right. Although we did have butterfly earlier. Yeah, we did, yeah. Right before we smashed the fuck out of the thing. I don't even know what that's called, a trebler. It's a trebler, isn't it? Yeah. Sliding trebler thing. Smashed the small rings. Um, yeah, the wind's just not playing ball. Um, we're going to have to do some big tacks, I think, Craig. Yeah. Get on and see if we can get on a beam reach. But then, even then, we can't let our traveller out. No, that's it. 
So it could be uh, three o'clock Thursday morning yeah. at this rate. Oh. Is that Pirate's Life, Kevin? Pirate's Life for me. Oh. Hi, Pirates. It's a lovely evening now. <clears throat> We're sailing away, no engine, driving up and down past Celsius Bill. Shallow bits, a Nelson SpongeBob beard at the helm. Oi, the artie! Jenny doing his business. Sun setting slowly down on the sea there. It's probably on the Isle of Wight. Isle of Wight. Isle of Wight. Anyway, One of them ones. What a lovely evening. Doing five knots or something? Yeah, between five and six. Between five and six. Driving up and down. Yeah, it's going to take us a while to get home. Yeah. We're going to do a lot more distance. We haven't used uh, as much diesel, or that much diesel, on that little trek, so we might do a little bit through the night, depending on how bad it gets weather wise or whatnot. Otherwise, yeah, it'd be nice if we can keep it to tight to the wind and motor some of the night would be good. Yeah, catch up a bit, just to be sure that we'll yeah, be there we'll really. And then we can uh, sort of take turns having a little rest in the dark. Yeah, and to swap sails around. Every 20 minutes or so. Right. She's settled down a bit now, the waves. Not as bad as they were earlier. <clears throat> that was absolute carnage. Sails set right, she sails nice. Beautiful. Captain, is it a pirate's life? It's pirate's life for me! Oh. Oh. Morning, pirates. It's Wednesday, the something or other of uh, August 2018. And the sun is just coming up. Just put oh for fuck's sake. Just poking her head out. There she is. We've been we've been going all night. It's been one of the maddest sailing experiences ever so far, that's for sure, isn't it, Craig? Mm. Yes, definitely. If it could have gone wrong, it pretty much has. Yeah. Um but we've done it, nearly. Fair enough. Where are we? We're just coming up past Hastings. No. Yeah? Yeah, uh, it's Hastings here. Yeah. Just coming up to Hastings there. So, not long to go now. A couple of hours and we'll be done, if that. So. Beautiful sunrise. Yeah. Brilliant. See you what, at one point I didn't think we was going to make it. But we didn't give up, did we? We had to fix both ends of the boom. Oh, craziness. Well, pirates, anyway, there's the sun coming up. Right, pirates. Where is it? The fairway boy. I don't know if you can see that. There it is. The fairway boy. We're back. We've made it. Against all the odds. I can't believe it. We couldn't motor because we didn't have any diesel and then the boom fell off so at one point we couldn't motor or sail but yet here we are we've done it <laughs> oh i'll tell you what pirates this was the scariest one yet yeah. hey wasn't it craig it was quite interesting oh god yeah. but uh but we're back now yeah. um it, what time is it craig uh what now is 20 to 9. so it's been about 19 hours or saying we've been sailing it's been bloody long and we've had some mega wind and mega waves all through the night and long old days and yeah. yeah and we nearly got run over by a navy ship and yeah. and all sorts of just craziness straight away from the beginning heavy seas it was yeah madness. right from the off as soon as we got out of that white cliff bay yeah. boom knocked it. us right down we didn't even have a chance to get the sails out properly did we nope Oh Mental. my god, it was absolutely nuts and it carried on like that basically the whole way. Yep. 
but there it is there's the boy so uh, we've now got to um, sit here till like, the tides are quarter to three so we can leave here about one ish yeah like so we've got our anchor till one yeah. so ideal opportunity to get a bit of shut eye and maybe catch some fish yep is it pirate's life craig pirate's life for me Arr! Lovely. Like hot knife through butter, mate. Yeah, handling well. Yeah. Good. She's a good girl, isn't she? She is a good girl. Good old girl. She's a good old girl. She's looked after us, even though uh, yeah. we're not the best sailors. Yeah. But we'll get there. And uh, we certainly practice. Yeah. <laughs> I lost count how many jibes we did. Tax on the way there. Here comes the one. Oh, we got in front of it, we? They always do get you, don't they? There he is, look! Sneaking up in front! We know you're there, mate! Come on! Show yourself! I think I scared him, Craig. Yeah, he'll splash me right in the face in a minute, mate. You're scared, aren't you? On you see, hey! It's because you know we're not scared of you. Well, we'll have a little bit. See, sky, see, sky. 
how we roll. No powerboat going down there. Fucking nutters on the beach, doing beach stuff in this. And in the not too far distance, Rye Harbour. Happy birthday Captain Craigus! Happy birthday <laughs> to you! Oh.